Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Kai's Life-Changing Bars. These were $1.98 each at Walmart. I have the peanut butter cookie. And I have the lemon cake. The, uh, they are both keto bars, uh, but mine has 10 grams of protein, 3 grams of sugar, 7 grams of net carbs. Mine is dairy-free and gluten-free. It is a 1.5 ounce bar, 42 grams. It's 210 calories. And these are made by, um, uh, it's www.kaisconcepts.com. And they're made in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. So, oh, and it says with each Kai's bar purchase, you are helping feed, support, and transform lives of those in need throughout the world. Primarily, your purchase impacts a community of 1,000 children in Haiti and help serve the poor, hungry, and youth in the Oklahoma City area. So that's why it's called a life-changing bar. That's why they put that on there. So it looks like a, a cookie. It, like it cookie. does look like a, a, like a chocolate chip cookie bar. Kind of shaped like a fig newt. Got that curve to it and the color. Peanut butter cookie. I get peanut butter flavor. I'm more of a peanut flavor. Yes, it tastes like um, like dry roasted peanuts. Mm -hmm. It's a dry bar. Too. Mm -hmm. It's a very dry bar. It's not bad. It's not bad. I got a little salt from the. The flavor's not bad at all. You know how uh, the peanut, when you take it out of the shell, sometimes you'll get that little skin. Yeah. I swear it. That's even a feel like, it feels like I got a piece of that. But it does taste like a peanut, mm -hmm. but it is a very dry bar. It's not bad, and there's a there's a flavor in there besides the peanut that's something, I don't know, like a bean or something. There's something natural. It um, says peanuts, egg white protein, coconut flour, coconut oil, uh, no added sugar, dark chocolate chips, unsweetened chocolate, cocoa butter, tapioca syrup, Stevia extract, monk fruit extract, sea salt. Yeah, I don't know. I don't it's, know what it is. It's a good bar. It's, it's good. just kind of dry. It's kind of dry and there's a, there's a little bit of something a little different in there than just peanut. I don't know what it is. Now, the, the lemon cake is uh, 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 gluten-free and keto, but it's also vegan. So, it has 10 grams of protein, 2 grams of sugar, 5 grams of net carbs. It is uh, 210 calories as well. When I say different, I don't necessarily mean bad. It's just no, bad. it's just, yes. Because, yeah, for me, uh, the difference in that bar is that, it, is that it's dry. Yeah, the texture. It's almost like they've taken a powder and then sh compressed that powder to where it all got compressed together at a high, high pressure pre uh, press and squished together. That's what it feels like. So it's like a, like a really dense powder. I could tell the minute that touched my tongue, I really like it. I know. Um, that one has a strange flavor too, but it's stronger. Oop. I don't care for the lemon. And the. Oh, it was painful. For easy. me, the peanut butter, it was fine it having that texture. Because you've had, you're used to having that texture in like peanut butter bars. Having that same texture with the lemon is just odd. And it's very, very dry. So with both of these being so dry, mm -hmm. they're both keto though. It makes me wonder if their other bars are dry. I went to their website and they have lots of other flavors. These are some other flavors that they have that are not keto. They have almond butter, almond butter chocolate sea salt, cinnamon roll, cocoa, Cookie dough, peanut butter, peanut butter chocolate chip, peanut butter crunch, vanilla almond, and chocolate brownie. Vegan bars, they have almond butter, chocolate sea salt, and chocolate brownie if you're vegan. And like I said, this uh, this um, lemon one was vegan. The lemon um, one is almond. They did have more of these Kai's bars in our Walmart. The reason we didn't get them is because these were the only two that they had that were single. 
The other ones were in a box of however many they come in, in a box, and we didn't want to spend that much money. We would prefer to try them in singles. Um, it does make me wonder if the regular bars, like I said, aren't so dry. However, after trying these, even though the peanut butter one was okay, I'm not interested in trying any others. No, the, the, the lemon one's almonds, by the way. There That's are the too ingredients. many bars out there. Yeah. Too many, even keto. Um, that are much better. That are, yes. That, the lemon one, I would never eat again. No, I didn't care for the lemon at all. Um, the peanut, I could, I could eat it, but I wouldn't choose to eat it. Right. There's too many other peanut butter bars to compare it with that, that just aren't that dry. Yeah. Not that it's bad. Out of the two, I would definitely pick the peanut butter one if you're looking for keto. Uh, but the, we've had other keto bars that I liked 10 times more, so I would just as soon get those. So even though it's not bad, it's just not a repurchase for us. Mm -hmm. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.